Hello, my name is Marie Contreras and I am the proud owner of Marie C. Pet Care. Nothing is more important than my family and my pets are part of the family in my house. For the last five years, I have dedicated myself to the world of pet care because I'm a pet lover at heart. I consider myself an environmentalist, an animal rights activist, and a staunch supporter of the scientific research behind proper animal care and welfare. My videos focus on pet care and tips for having healthy and happy pets. I hope you stick around and enjoy what I have created for you today. Have you recently adopted a new cat? Are they driving you crazy with all the scratching? Are they attacking your favorite chair or couch? In this video, I will share some easy tips that will help you save your furniture from your cat's scratching before you need new furniture or lose your mind. Today's video is sponsored by Good Dogs, a foolproof guide for having happy and healthy dogs. Yes, I wrote this book. I don't have any real sponsors yet, but this is a great book. If you have dogs or you know somebody who has a dog, you can find it on Kindle, in paperback on Amazon, and now it's also available on Audible. So you can listen to it while you're driving around. Anyway, back to today's program. Some people choose to declaw their cat because of the damage cats can cause to furniture. This is never advised. Declawing is a drastic and extreme measure that can cause permanent damage to your cat, is extremely painful, and leaves your cat defenseless. There are other options that work. Number one, have scratching posts or other scratching areas where your cat can scratch. Your cat instinctively wants to stretch and wear down their claws. Outside, they do this by scratching and climbing trees. Have things that your cat can scratch, like scratching posts and cat towers to climb. Number two, choose upholstery that cats don't enjoy scratching, like velvets. The more open the weave of upholstery, the, the more cats love scratching it. They don't enjoy scratching on velvet or suede type fabrics, but burlap and more loosely woven fabrics like linens seem to call to cats. They love scratching these looser weaved fabrics. Number three, keep your cat's claws trimmed. Cats with shorter claws scratch less, and it's not hard to do. If you practice with just some little nippers early when you get your cat, then they will let you do this, and it makes it much easier if their nails are already trimmed. Number four, have a spray bottle near you. Teach your cat that scratching on the furniture is not acceptable by saying a firm no while giving them a quick spritz from a water bottle. Cats will learn no very quickly if you add water, that the furniture is off limits, but you need to be consistent and not let your guard down. Number five, double-sided sticky tape is great if you're not home all the time, which that's most of us. Cats do not like the way double-sided tape feels on their paws. This method works, but you may need to reapply the tape if you're using the normal little double-sided tape that you use to wrap gifts. They do make a thicker, heavier, wider tape that is specifically for this reason. Getting the wider double-sided tape designed as a cat deterrent lasts a lot longer, and in the end, it's going to be less expensive and more durable. It is clear and it's hard to notice. They, make, they even make larger sheets that you can put on the whole side of a chair or the whole side of a couch, and these work really well. I have them in my own home when I was training my cats and it's clear and it's hard to notice. It does attract hair and dirt as it's sticky on both sides, so you may need to replace it as it becomes soiled. It's much easier to replace the, the tape or the shields that they have than your furniture. I hope this quick video helped. Bye for now. If you enjoyed this video, nudge the like button. If you would like to see more like this, consider subscribing. If you would like to read the blog or check out my new book, I'm going to leave links to them in the description. Thank you for watching.